morning, sir. Good morning, my dear. How are you? I'm fine, sir. And your mother, has she left for the market? Yes, she has gone to the market. She left before I woke up. Oh, that your mother is something else. Very hardworking woman. Uh, I think my brother is um, very lucky to have had her as a wife. Yes, sir. That's why I pray to God to bless me with my mother's sterling qualities. Hmm. Our type is hard to come by. All right, I... I'm going to the office. We have uh, the meeting with the local government chairman for 9 a.m. I don't want to be late. So I'll see you later. Okay, sir. All right, my dear. Okay. Alice! Alice, stop that! Where do you think you're going? Eh? You must complete that money before you step out of this house. Only I can sell my foot. <laughs> Nana, tell this good for nothing cow to leave my share before I till my money. Before you do what? What will you do? I told you to take me back to my parents alive. Else you convert my dead body to them. You sterile man. What did you call me? I called your sterile man and what will you do? Auntie, Auntie, oh, Auntie, 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 what is it going to them now? People are watching. Oh, let them watch now. Let them watch their castrated he goats. Hey. And for your information, just watch your tongue. Watch your tongue and let me finish with this man. Give me my money. Leave my suit this minute before I... Before you do what? Before you do what, you're a stupid man! You want to fight? Yes! Okay. Foolish chance to tell Stupid man! Catch your little vehicles! Me? Yes, you! You know you're fighting an honorable member of a... Let's go in the fight. Just give me that money. Give me that money! You don't know I am an honorable member! What do you think you are? You are looking for the castrated vehicles! That's what you have! Okay. <laughs> You cannot bring for a shame to my exalted political position in this town. You cannot. They're too small. You are not even ashamed of yourself. Ernest, look at you. In fact, I always imagine why our people should elect you as a counselor, giving a safer position to, to a dog like you. Shame to you. Shame to you. Look at you. I was elected, I was also selected as a counselor. Mm -hmm. Of this town. But you, I have given you money to set up this money. What have you done with it? Wasted it. You should be a beggar. Eh? You don't have a time for me. You have no business. Look at him now. Can you compare yourself to her? Go ahead. Go ahead and call me Jens. But one day I must reveal your dirty daughters to the villagers. So that they will know this left to women's man's care they have as a counselor. Rubbish! An idiot. Other couples will sit down amicably and resolve issues. Not your ah, no sense. It's, 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 it's up to you. Ernest, it's up to you. If you want us to settle it, fine. If you don't want us to settle it, then I'm ready for you. How much do you need? It's 10,000 naira and stop asking stupid questions. And let me warn you. Let today be the first and last you will question my authority in this house. Nonsense. You are no here. It was you. Get it to me! Rebecca. Why must you fight your husband again today? Disturbing him from going to work early. <coughs> Mama Nena. Mm -hmm. That man is a useless good for nothing man. Imagine him giving me 3,000 naira when I asked for 10,000. Hmm. Rebecca. You may not understand the damage you are causing until you lose your husband. <laughs> Who cares? After all, I'm still young and fresh. And there are so many young rich guys out there waiting for me. Hmm? <laughs> Rebecca, a cow never values its tail until she loses it. You don't know what widows like us 
are passing through. Listen, the worst thing you can wish your enemy is widowhood. Please, in name. Take good care of your husband. Mama Nena, mm -hmm. if you don't want me to leave this food for you, then please let's not talk about NS here. Even I prefer to be a widow. What? Rebecca! What? Auntie? My dear, your bathroom water is ready. Oh, bring it closer, let me feel it. Oh! Nena! But this is too hot. Or do you want it to peel the skin? Huh? Has Anes bribed you to kill me? Auntie, no, no. Then take it back and add more cold water in it. Yes, Auntie. Oh. I wish somebody could come and scrub this my skin for me. I'm so tired. Mm -hmm. Um, Rebecca, I thought you wanted to accompany me to the farm. Me? Farm. <laughs> God forbid. I'm not meant to go to the farm. I need a very nice sleep. You know, it's good to rest the eyes after a luscious meal like this. It's good for you, Nim. As for me, after this meal, I'm going to the farm. That's it. I'm too clean to go to the farm. <laughs> Why are you mad? Why are you mad? Mm -hmm. It's not your fault, my dear. Mm -hmm. mm. Ah. I'm done, no Rebecca, Rebecca! Ennis, are you mad? Why are you disturbing my sister? You're a lazy boy. Stop whining away your life. She couldn't even wash this simple clothes I asked you to wash for me. Eh? Me? Yes. Me, lazy boy. That's what you are. I don't blame you. Randy dishonored the idiot. Hey! 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 Whatever the problem is, it could be solved amicably. No. Please don't kill her. I regret that I met her. She's lazy, she's unproductive, and she doesn't have a child for me. All she gives me is trouble. Hey. Mm. You don't say that Rebecca is lazy. Remember, you caused it. Several times she accused you of not allowing or encouraging her to do anything while people were in the city. You wanted her for a housewife. Ma, why are you complaining? Why? Secondly, honest. God is the giver of kids. So you're supporting her? Not that I'm supporting her. You're supporting a cost woman. She's always making trouble. That's all she knows how to do. Remember, you are an honorable counselor. And the moment people out there noticed your constant quarrel with your wife, the more you are dragging your image to the mud. So honest, you think, please. I'm on my knees. Please. I know you are hungry. Let me go and prepare your food. Yes, I'm very hungry. She can't even prepare an ordinary meal. It's okay. All she knows is to raise her voice. It's okay. Rant all over the place. Honorable. Honorable counselor. <laughs> Just give me a few minutes to go and prepare your meal, okay? Hmm?
Ernest, your food is ready. I'm not hungry. Ernest, I said your food is on the dining table. And I said I am not hungry. I have eaten a better meal and I don't want to waste the taste with that your conquer mixture. You are a very hopeless man. And better watch your tongue before I make you chew your words. And by the way, where did you eat? At Chidema, my late brother's wife's house. God must bless that woman for me. I wish I married her type. You're a hopeless man. Why didn't you marry her then? Eh? Why? And let me warn you, from now on you must choose between I and Chidema whom to marry. You're an idiot. You are an idiot. Instead of you to amend your ways and be a better woman. Yeah, yeah, you're talking nonsense. Yeah. What stupid amend? Eh? What stupid amend, you hopeless man? You're not ashamed of yourself. You went to another woman's house and ate food. You are not ashamed. Foolish, hopeless man. Anyway. Talking to you is like wasting this good food. I cannot waste it. Welcome. Thank you. Uh, take out the yams from the boat. You're welcome. Thank you. How was your face? Mm, my dear, I love you. Okay. okay. Now, share them into equal proportions. What is going on here? <laughs> well, I just saw them on the way and I bought them. Mm -hmm. Hi, Nest. Yeah. You're welcome. Thank you, my dear. Them, uh, take a portion as the eldest and the first wife of the family. Ernest, no. Rebecca is the first. After all, she's the first lady. Um, no, there's no problem. Go ahead. His Excellency has decreed. So. <laughs> okay. Nene. Take this one to your uncle's house. After you come and pack ours. Rebecca, I appreciate. Thank you very much for your care towards my children and I. And to you, honestly, thanks for your care. In fact, since my husband and Warren died, you have been always there for us. Feeling the vacuum his death created. Thank you and God bless. Thank you for appreciating the gesture. Chidema, you are my responsibility. My brother handed you over to me to care and to help you in every circumstance. 
So I am only fulfilling the responsibility due to me. And it's my design that everybody is happy and that's what I am doing. Uncle, thank you. Thank you, my dear. Auntie, thank you. You're welcome. Okay. of insulting me. Why? My problem with you is that you talk like somebody in a mental home. A mad woman. It is you who is mad. What is wrong with you? Every day you keep denying me my respect as a wife. And upon that you win a business on me. I am not surprised. That sickness that drove your mother to an early grave has taken possession of you. Of course. When I came to marry you, I was told your mother died in chains. I wish you the same. And what killed my mother must kill you, fool. I'm oh, ashamed of you. You don't deserve to be called a wife. There are women, but you're a woe. I have the right to share my property as I like, without prejudice. Including sharing things equally and publicly between you and Mana, eh? Oh, I see you're jealous. It is that jealousy that will kill you. Well, wait, wait, you must give me my respect as a wife. <laughs> <laughs> You're a foolish man! You're a foolish man! I don't know. It's just... It's just... It's just... It's just... It's just... It's just... It's You will go back to school with it. You know our family's financial strength. So I want you to utilize that money judiciously. Uncle, this is more than enough now. Thank you so much. God will reward you abundantly. My semester is already made. That's good. And one more thing, and very importantly too, you're a grown lady. I want you to do everything possible to imbibe your mother's values. Your mother is a very virtuous woman, responsible, dedicated, and hardworking. I'm sure and I'm convinced that if you imbibe her qualities, you will excel in life. Uncle, you're more than a father to me. I can't pray for a better uncle in life. Thank you. Thank you. Now, uh, run along. But don't forget to get back home here whenever you need anything. Okay, thank you. I'm very grateful. Good. You're very wonderful. Thank you, sir. Okay, go and get rest. Oh, Mama Nenna, let's go, please. I'm tired. I, I, I don't even know what is biting me here. Please, let's go. Hey, my We've been here for an hour or thereabouts. Let's walk till 3 or 4 p.m. Please, God forbid. It's never my portion. Uh -uh. After all, some of my mates are either in the banks walking. And here I am suffering. Please, Mama Nenna, don't even bring me to this farm again. Listen, my Emma. You should learn how to do all this. Because nobody knows tomorrow. Look at me. If I'm not industrious, tell me what I could have done to feed my children. Hey. My husband is no more. That's the way you want it. Should Ernest die today without leaving sufficient amount of money for me? <laughs> I'll remarry, of course you know. And I'll live my life the way I want it. But, come to think of it, Mama Nenna. Are you not lucky to have your husband dead? What boss will give Allah? To fear a quack! Why, Okay. Is that the reason you are denying Ernest your body? What? Yes. He always complained to me that you are avoiding him like a, a plague. What sort of rubbish is this? Huh? 
Why was Sennes report every of her bedroom secrets to you? Eh? Why? Is he mad? Because I'm his wife. Or do I look like a stranger before you? Is <laughs> you are his wife? Yes, of course. Uh, I'm his wife. Aye. Uh, his wife. Hmm. Well, you are right too. But please, can we go now? I'm tired. Um, Manena, since you are like his wife, you can as well bring all these things while coming back. Manima! Manima! Oh, Nim. Eat by my rug. Hugo, mm -hmm. hey, what a surprise. I'm here to You're see welcome. you. You're welcome. Thank you. I hope there's no problem. No problem at all. Okay, we can go inside at all. I was about going now, but it's, it's okay. 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 Oh, Are you sure? Oh, oh. Okay. Rebecca, check it out. Emokwanya. See, oh, you have to be extra careful. Else, if a mother will phone you. I don't understand. It's about Chidemai, your husband. Don't tell me you don't understand. Uh, no, 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 no. I don't envisage any danger in my husband showering love and care to his late brother's family. Uh, no, 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 no. Please, please, Mugo, no. no. <laughs> <laughs> my friend, I don't mean to bring disunity in your family. But remember, you don't have a child. You must sit up and possess your possession. Mm. Well, thank you very much for that, Mugo. But if I may say, you are simply sowing a seed of discord. I can never stop the generosity of my husband to Chedema. Besides, he will never remarry her. The worst thing he can do is to go out there and take a second wife. <sighs> Please, Mugo, forgive me if I have said anything wrongly. But always shine your eyes. They said that the rat can never eat anything belonging to a man who is awake. I should shut my eyes. Now get out. I should get out. I said get out. Leave I should get out. Once. Leave my compound at once. Which? This is how you'll be going about the village telling tales. Come on, get out. I should get out. When your calamity starts, don't hesitate to call me because I'll be there to give me my shoulder to cry on. Why not wait and give me that stupid shoulder of yours to cry on? We shall see. What am I waiting for? Get out of here. Get out. It is you who will never find peace in her own family. Wicked woman. I will see you. Idiot. Let me get you here again. Let me get you. Foolish woman. Obuashere. Idiot. No, Hugo, come back. Come back! You should have waited there, idiot! Foolish woman! Nem. You went to drop Nen at the motor park. Mm. You're welcome. Thank you, my dear. Why is your face like this? It's me and my God. In fact, I'm tired of this wicked world. I am just tired of this wicked world. Why won't you be tired of this world? When well, you can't even keep your immediate environment clean. Look at, look at, look at all this. Look at you. Talking about being tired. Lazy bone. No, wait, wait. Let you uh, raise your leg and sweep the dirt off. And sweep the whole compound while you lousy around. Ernest. 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 How many times did I call you? Eh? Let today be the first and last. In fact, never you ever, ever again in your life try to compare Chidi and I or try to use Chidi Man as a role model to me. Idiot. You don't listen to villagers. Shameless man. Listen to villagers. As in what? 
Am I an armed robber or a fraudster? You are worse than that. You are worse than armed robbers. Woman bottom. Hey. Hey, it's okay. Come on. 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 Michael, honestly, you're a strong man, jokes are bad. <laughs> but see, Zubi, I knew what I had to do at that point in time, you know? You know how much I loved Benita? Of course I do. Yet she dumped me as if I'm a bad habit for an Italian boyfriend. So, Zubi, what do you expect me to do? Do you expect me to die? No, 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 no. no. It's just that I'm actually amazed by your level of maturity and the exhibition of manhood. Exactly. I mean... What a heartbreak. Zubi, something else. Just two weeks to our traditional wedding, Benita disappeared. Just like that. The things women do. The things women do. Yes, come right in. Hey. Oh. That's my pretty. Pretty girl. When did you blow into town? I mean, just yesterday. Yeah. Hi, Mike. Hi, Nena. I think it's time for me to leave you and Zubi. I have to leave you people, okay? <laughs> just see who is talking, Mr. Big Eye. Jealousy! Do you know I'm jealous? How do you know? And I don't <laughs> mind, Mike. Yours is sweeter. It's the same thing. Get okay, there's this. So, honey, how is Mama? Mama is fine. She extends her regards. I know she'll be wondering why I didn't visit you throughout your long vacation at home. She was so worried I had to tell her you traveled. Oh, that's very good of you. After all, I didn't make bad choice of you. Um, you should be defending me always. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I won't defend you next time. By the way, why didn't you visit? Mm, baby, I was uh, so much engrossed with uh, business. The very day I decided to come, my containers arrived, and um, I need to sit back and uh, take care of them. You always give one reason or the other to cover up. When you see Mama, you sort it out with her. I'll only be an observer. Hmm. 
If you say you won't defend me, I'll just keep this drink for you and you take it all alone. Honey, take your drink. I'll always defend you. I'll always defend you. Are you sure? I'm sure. I'll always sure? Defend you. Yes. Okay. That's my baby. Hope you're fine now. Fine. Hope you're feeling better. I've always been fine. <laughs> yeah. coming from? Go back to wherever you're coming from and sleep there. Now listen, if this is a joke, you must stop it. Who is joking with you? Go back to wherever you're coming from. Ernest, what is going on here? Why are you still standing outside? She wouldn't let me in. Rebecca! Rebecca, what is wrong with you? Were you not aware that your husband was in my house? And what was he discussing in your house at this time of the night? What? Rebecca, I'm asking you. When did you start regulating time for us? Did your husband go to anywhere else than my house? You're a stupid woman. Eh? Chidi, I said you're a very complex woman. What was he discussing with you? What relationship has a married man with a widow? God. Watch the things you say, idiot. Will you shut up your mouth, this hopeless thing? Oh, you started again, eh? All right, come and enter this house. Let me see. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Don't mind her. Two people cannot be mad at the same time. Just go back. I'll take care of it. Please. You. I will stop at nothing to destroy your political ambitions if you continue to make me feel inferior by comparing to the man I. Look at the way you're shouting. Huh? Look at the way you're shouting. I will not shout back at you because to put us at the same level. Huh? But I will stop at nothing until you change for the better to compare you and Chidema. Mm. Because she's my ideal woman. Mm. Humble, mm -hmm. hardworking, responsible. What are you? A direct and arrogant opposite. Look at who he's talking. Just look at who he's talking. Shameless left winner. You want me to spill the beans? Eh? Do you want me to spill the beans? Have you forgotten Ernest? What drove us back to the village? What now? Eh? I must expose you! I will tell the whole villagers whom you are. You! You don't need to shout. Hey, hey, don't come close to me. Don't touch me. You can't fool me. You can't fool me. We have an understanding on this. Huh? Okay, I will not question your authority. <laughs> I'm with my sister. See me, see law. Who said Zubi will not kill me with law? Try to let me out. Lucy. Hey, Nakey. Nemaidi. 
see clues. All designers. Are you telling me? In fact, Zubi is your rightful heart throb. You ain't heard or seen anything. Zubi gave me 50,000 naira for my school fees, handouts, and pocket money. Now this is all no. You won't be luckier than this, so. Are you telling me? In fact, Zubi is my ideal man. Eh? Amaka, not my Zubi. Hey. Stop it. Hey. 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 Don't tell me you are that jealous. I am more than jealous. So. Extra possessive. In fact, let us go for lectures. Zubi will roast me alive if I fail any course this semester. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Stand up for me. Let's go. Nana. The story I am telling you is just man to man. I see it from the elder's view point. What happened was a mistake. Eh? I didn't plan it. Why? It was just unfortunate that my wife came and caught me and the little girl. And since then, she cannot finish a sentence without punctuating it with the slave to little girl's pants. Ernest, now tell me, are you not a disgrace? Huh? In that case, Rebecca has a deadly edge over you. She holds the S. Why would you rep a little girl? Eh? Are you not ashamed of yourself? That's what I'm telling you. I was just trying to play smart as a man. Will you shut up? I say shut up. Just listen to yourself. In fact, let me tell you, you are not supposed to be the counselor you are. What if your political opponent catch you? Don't you know it is enough reason to send you to prison? Huh? Hi. Awa. You didn't look where men were here. The second thing that happened is something I cannot fathom. It happened while I was living in the city between me and You did say the fear your face? Where you go send me to bring your bill come? You go consume light, you consume water, bill go come, you don't go pay. And they say you You want me to clean my cup light? Look, give the cup light, then you go put it for one thousand. My friend, go bring your bacon. So, Ernest, you don't fear me? Fear you? Me? You are my bro. I'm a kobo kobo. Because, say, you don't get money, you can't challenge me. I'm a mini abo. Ah. Take it by me. If you, if, if you like, speak it, check it. That one on your own. My own be say, go bring your bacon. That's why you're going to go, 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 go. Don't hold and bite. You know they make you hold, 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 You know they back. You go back. Just bite straight. To the less good dog. Ah! My boy. And me to the less To the less Yeah. Now you. Go bring your bill. Come. I will show you, say, there is plenty of teeth in this mouth. Look, I won't wait for my room. Bring my bring the big call. Hey, since then, my life has never been the same. Hey. Mami Yabo threatened. Cost. And she will finish me. She hit my chest. That even sometimes I have chest pain. Since then. My life has just turned around. That is the genesis of the whole thing. Listen, you must go and look for that woman and beg her. She might be responsible for a wise or badness and all these problems she will be passing through.
Zubi, I was accusing in Nenna that maybe she provoked you. Hence, throughout their long vacation, you did not visit her. <laughs> Ma, there was no cause for alarm. It's just that I was extra busy. So the new contract I got is taking all my time. So that was why I didn't visit. <laughs> I'm so sorry. That's okay. My son, as long as uh, the contract comes with the big money, uh, take more than 24 hours a day. Hey, Nanyo <laughs> Zuronye. <laughs> anyway, he's right. Zubi, we who are here in the village are praying for such job. As long as the money is good. <laughs> uh, as my eldest uncle, here is the drink that uh, Azubike brought. I want you to respond to his request. My son, you are welcome. Thank you, sir. Your journey is good. Hence, uh, you, you come in peace. We shall also live in peace. He said. Uh -huh. My son, you have to bring 500 naira to accompany this drink. Eh? That is uh, as a tradition demands. Eh? Okay, so many know why you want your well now, Oh, my son. I said 500 naira, and you are bringing 1,000 naira. Yes, I heard you right. I can pay anything to have a as my wife. <laughs> Children of nowadays, they can spend anything to have their, uh, uh, what do they call it? Um, uh, uh, Eko. Eko. <laughs> well, um, we're very proud of Nena. She's our daughter. You're very lucky. But all the same, let us uh, give all the thanks to her mother. She brought her up very well. I don't need to be told you, sir. Uh, how I wish you can tell me how much I should pay now and uh, she becomes my wife one time. <laughs> uh, just like that. <laughs> Please take it easy. Uh, tell him, <laughs> tell him that this road leads to a uh, uh, stream, not firewood road. My son, you have to take it easy. No hurry in life. Eh? Um, we have to consult uh, our case men and our daughter hmm? for verification and the acceptance. Oh, yes, yes. Then after the consultations, a message will be sent across to you. Uh, then you can come with your parents and kinsmen for the marriage details. Yes, now. Um, eh? One person cannot single-handedly marry a woman. Bam! Ah! Ibe man, when? When? Where's your name? Okay, so me. When are that? Bring the food. Okay. Mm. Mm. <laughs> I'll do it for the way out. You better be fast now. Ah, what all this all this did they die about food? I'm 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 hungry. Better don't thank your God. Because if I were in my mood, I wouldn't have brought this food. You don't need to be told. Please, uh, Your Excellency, don't be angry. Eh? It's just that uh, only put you walking. Where is the food now? Am I going to drink the soup alone? My friend, keep quiet there. Ah, you're not the only one hungry. What's wrong with you? Come. So you have degenerated to the level of buying food from outside? Eh? Do you realize my political position in this community? What political position? Eh? Councillorship you won through rigging. By the way, who do you think respects you here in this village? Huh? As far as I'm concerned, you're a kitchen counselor. And if you don't eat this fufu, that's your ill luck. Come back here! 
What kind of devil are you? Eh? Don't you know they can my political detractors can poison me through even as well? That's your business. Let them poison you. No, I think you're gonna get it. What's wrong with this one? Marco, forget it. This is Lolo. Tolerate you better. If you kill her because of food, what do people have then say? Both of you cannot be hot tempered. Rebecca is better dead than be alive and torment me. Frustrate my whole life. Eat your food. I've told you, anytime you are hungry, come over here and eat. Instead of beating her at any slightest chance. This is how good food should be. Look at it. It's inviting. It's very presentable. It's okay. Huh? Her own is all she cooks is conquer mister. It's so <laughs> honorable. All she knows is to give me trouble. That's okay. I know you like it, don't you? you don't need an oracle to tell you that this, this food is sweet. <laughs> I just pray that in my next world I'll marry her type. Honorable. Not somebody who makes trouble every day. Two of you are of the same kind. God is wise, imagine both of you. Mbao. Hmm? That was a mistake made in hell. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. Enjoy your food. <laughs> yes. Yeah, it's 20,000 naira. What you asked for was 15,000. It's for the uniform. And whose one is this? It's for Chidema. I want to give her 10,000 naira to augment her expenses. This August meeting is costing too much. Mm -hmm. What's the meaning of that? Over my dead body, will any of your cobo enter Chidema's hand again? What's all this nonsense? You are telling lies. Because you cannot tell me how to spend my money. But give me that I'm money. I'm not giving you. I would rather give her money because she does not lavish money the way you do. Give me that money now. I'm not giving you any money. Ah, if you like, you can beat me. I'm not giving you. Give me that money, my friend. Give me that money. Give me that money. Give me that money. Give me that money. I'll show you. I can spend my money and do how I like. Do you know how much I had to beg the chairman to sign my voucher? I only to spend money. MNK, for the last time, I'm warning you, leave my compound with your sister. If not, I'll shed blood. I'm not going anywhere. I'm not leaving this compound. You think I don't know your plans? You want me outside that you remarry Chidema? 
That plan shall not work for both of you. Rebecca, what nonsense are you talking about? Do you realize the implication of your stupid utterances? To hell with you! I said to hell with you, you stupid woman! You think I don't know your tricks? You want to take my place as an ex-wife? It shall not work for you, Eko Isu! It shall not work! Now, Israel, can you imagine the abomination Rebecca is talking about? Source of Chukuma. Only God knows if I have ever thought of remarrying Ernest. May I follow my husband now? Show your husband! But if I'm not! But if I'm not! Yes, I, I said shut up! Shut up! Let's find a solution to this matter. Huh? No, 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 I don't know the what solution you want to proffer. But my own is that this woman here, as a matter of fact, should allow my sister to enjoy her husband. Secondly, Emma should be one to desist from using my sister as a punching bag. Period. Yes, I will react. You react? Yes. I will act before you react. You come to my combat to warn me. You! You're a beef! And I'm gonna prove it to you. Just wait. I will deal with you. I will deal with you. You must die. You. Everybody is with the wish. You must be this. You must die. You must be You must die. You must be You must die. You must be You You must be You must 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 it's okay. I will shoot you down and scatter your afro. It's okay. Let's Idiot. Go. You will commit murder. Let's go. Rebecca must regret this. It's okay. Go to the apartment. Let's go. Go to the apartment. And you just allowed me to shoot you. Let's go. You must regret this. Now Rebecca, tell me, if I was shot by Ernest, what would her parents say? What would they say? What do you mean? Was I wrong to have invited you to come and warn my husband against my treating me because of Chizema? Eh? Grassy Dan, you are my sister. I know that you're a troubleshooter. And how are you sure Chizema wants to snatch Ernest from you? How are you sure? May the spirit of our grandfather strike you dead. Fool! Oh, you have been petals to call me a troubleshooter. Eh? You are supporting the man too. Now I know you are supporting them to kill me! Foolish man! May that spirit first take you! How would any man like to keep you as a wife? Lazy fool! You are even unproductive! Call me next time and see if the gods will not condemn you, as they have done already! Ah. Emenike! Nonsense! Emenike, me! Unproductive! You are a devil! Hey! A person idiot! You! Hey! I don't know what to do, I don't know I don't know what to do, 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 I do I command you to come now. Appear. We bought a bus of bus of Biakala to buy the Odyssey Buru. We never had to get more booty of that one, my joy. Woman, I warned you against telling lies here in my shrine, didn't I? Nani, I didn't lie. That one is an obstacle to my family. She snatched my husband away from me and gave him love portion. Shut up! Shut up! Who told you? Instead of pleading for your guilt, you are committing much more. Hey! Hey! Why you told me to talk it? You told me to talk it. You told me to come and I can't get you to go like that. Why I got my nails up? Woman, now you will die in her place. Nani, why? Please forgive me. Forgive me. I'm. I'm guilty. Yes, I'm guilty. No, please forgive me. You are warned. Well, now you can see. Nobody can kill her. She is innocent. Nani, but I want her to suffer. She's a witch. She's a witch. Now, woman, will you be ready to 
carry the consequence this will result to. Yes, Nanyo Kaome. My heart is strong and nothing will happen. And should there be anything, may it be upon my head. Woman, as you said, so shall it be. Now listen, you have to go and come back on the next encode day with the flowing items. A piece of her cloth. Hair is from her head. A bottle of red oil. And 20,000 naira. Now you can go. Um, uh, Nani, is that all? Uh, no. Uh, and 10,000 naira for my labor. Okay, Nani. Nani, thank you. Rebecca Munyedin. If somebody advised or told you that I want to snatch Annes from you. Would you believe the person? Mama Nana, that's why I'm here to ask for forgiveness. I was blinded by fury. Please forgive me. I've forgiven you. As long as you have decided to be a low ranger. I will from henceforth keep distance. Because I wouldn't like to come closer to either you or your husband. So that peace will be kept in your home. Mama Nena, please. Don't bring hatred into this. Remember, there's no cordial relationship without a misunderstanding. Please. You better come back. My late father, when he was alive, he used to tell us that a man killed by train is death. In the other way around, the Yubo man said, to be forewarned is to be forearmed. After all, what do you want to do with a wretched widow like me? Ah, Mama Nena, please. You are taking this to the extreme. Huh? Let's remain the way we were. Oh, I've accepted. But that will be by tomorrow. <laughs> please, just let's forget the past. Hmm? I don't even know when you learned how to be over angry. You taught me. <laughs> <laughs> Have you forgot? <laughs> <laughs> Rebecca, you know, the mind is deceitful. I'm sorry, please. Mm. I'm sorry. Oh. Forgive me. Mm. Honey, you are becoming old as the day passed by. <laughs> Before I go. Anyway, even as I get older, I can still marry more wives if I like. Oh, really? Don't let any of them come in and see if I won't break her head. <laughs> Are you that jealous of me? No. Why won't I be jealous? Or do you want ladies these days to take my only happiness away from me? Ah. So you have purposely been picking quarrels with me? But of course. To know if you still love me. You know, each time I quarrel with you, I feel like chewing you up when in bed. There's your crop with Ali. Okay. Uh, let's go in and quarrel. Not so fast. You have to promise to give me 20,000 naira to buy a wrapper after the Holy War. Hmm? Now I see where you're coming from. Hmm? It's a bit, huh? Come on, you have to <laughs> promise me. Hmm? Okay. I'll give you 40,000 naira. What? Let's go and quarrel. 40,000. Oh, my baby. <laughs> it's not going to quarrel last. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> You've not changed, huh? Me? Yes. Don't joke with me. I'm younger than you. No, younger. I didn't believe it myself. The money just disappeared like magic. 
If I could look up, the boy has taken to his heels. <laughs> Don't tell me you haven't noticed that Livinus has fast fingers. Have you forgotten the day he came here and stole the farm my husband wanted to use for Thanksgiving? Have you? You are right. That's the same boy. Mm -hmm. Livinus. Mm -hmm. Wait, let me show you the container where I hid the money. Ah, Mama Nena, you don't need to show me. Hey. <laughs> okay, oh. Hmm. Hi. Oh, Rebecca, my oh, boy is a criminal, honestly. Siri, I hid the man. Yes? Still, he went and found it. That boy is a criminal. I don't know how he found it. And then. <laughs> hey, Mama Nena, please. Keep it. It's now a history. Just don't mind him. And I'm sure his parents will not believe that he committed the offense. That boy is a born criminal. He is. Livinus. Hi. If you ask me, he's a criminal. Hey. Oh. Rebecca, that boy is a criminal, honestly. Siri, I hid the man. Yes? Still, he yes? went and found it. That boy is a criminal. I don't know how he found it. And then... <laughs> hey, Mama Nena, please. Keep it. It's now a history. Just don't mind him. And I'm sure his parents will not believe that he committed the offense. That boy is a born criminal. He is. Livinus. <laughs> Hi. If you ask me, he's a criminal, though. Mama Nena, mm -hmm. I have to go now. Because I'm doing something in the house. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Just have to go now. Okay. You just wait a minute. Yes, we will, though. Maybe after the evening food. Uh, I might come back later. Okay. All right. Ali Chiman. Anyhow, you fix it. Fan work has not given me time to take care of myself. Mama, mm. take it easy. The way you are going about with this farm work is terrible. <laughs> Even the villagers are complaining. My daughter, let them complain. Ever since I lost my husband, has any of them given me help or a cup of Gary? Should I decide to abandon the farm work, what will I use to train my children? That farm work is the only source of our livelihood. Hmm. Oh, they're not saying she abandoned the farm work. But to reduce hand a little. Hmm? Mama Nena, why now? Nanima. Hey, you should have told me you needed your hair plated. Hmm. I don't I plate very well. Ah, no, it has not come to that. Only I don't want to worry because of your visitor. So I sent for Oluchi. There's no problem. There's no problem, eh? My dear, let me help you. Go inside and get me drinking water. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Nena sent a message that she'll be coming tomorrow with Zubi to pick up a date for their traditional wedding. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hey, Nena! Mm -hmm. Hey! <gasps> I thank God for everything. No wonder you decided to plate your hair. <laughs> <laughs> because I know you, <laughs> Baker woman. Uh -uh. <laughs> Don't call me Baker. I'm not in Baker. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so happy my, for my, you. Thank God. I'm so happy God. for you. Do you need more? Um. <laughs> thank you. My man, do you need some thread? thread? Yes, please. Uh, make it three. Mm. Come on, then I'm happy for you. Oh, I thank God for everything. Mm -hmm. At last, some worker woman changed her mind. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Rebecca, stop calling me. Hey, but it's now. true now. <laughs> hey. Yeah. Oh. Mm, I thank God for you.
so we get you. You mean your master drove you out from the shop simply because you mistakenly broke a 14 inch television? Yes, uncle. And you want me not to return to the store till I bring the money for you? I mean, can you imagine such a senseless talk by Chippewa? Man is even like his man. You mean your case man can wickedly manhandle your kid brother this way? I had to sleep outside for three days before I could bring my transport fare down here. Jesus Christ! And uh, what is the cost of the broken television that you have to be outside for three days? It's fourteen thousand five hundred naira. So the set is that cheap? Why don't she we throw you out because of that little change? Even if it involves a lot of money. Why won't he? Why won't he? He knows our father is late and there is no one else to help us except Uncle Ernest. I thank God for your entrance into my life. It's alright, honey. Hmm? Don't bother yourself, it's well. Um, the KG. Okay. Your coming is godly and timely. Uh, you have to get ready. You'll be traveling with us tomorrow to your hometown. Yes, uh, from there, you go back to your base. Meanwhile, I'll give you 25,000 naira, okay? Uh, settle your master and keep the rest as your pocket money. Thank you, Uncle. Honey? Excuse me. That thank you. In fact, God will bless your mind with Uncle Zubi in Jesus' name. Amen. Take your drink. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> hey God, Mama Nenda. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, huh. in three days' time, you'll be finally married. Congratulations. Thank you. It's the Lord's doing that I'm not only getting married, but to a man after my own heart. Mm -hmm. It's a dream come true. Mm -hmm. Mama. Mm -hmm. Papaya. Mama. <laughs> I know that your late father will not hesitate to reincarnate. That is, if the theory of reincarnation is true. Mm -hmm. No, Mama. Papa must first reincarnate to me as the man in the house before sister. Man of the house. Mama. <laughs> Ikechi, should your father decide to wait for you, that means he wants to overstay his welcome in the spirit world. Exactly. I heard that. I heard that. Ikechi, listen. You must go back to the city and face your master, Igwe Okolo's tribunal, before you talk about marriage and oh. reincarnation. Oh. <laughs> anyway, um. Here, 30,000 naira. This is to prepare some good food for Azubiki and his people. Hey. Mm. Honestly, Dim. I don't know how to thank you. But may the good Lord continue to bless you abundantly. Thank you very much. Thank you. Rebecca, I'm not mm -hmm. Rebecca. Mm -hmm, it's okay. Uncle. Uncle, thank you. Thank you so very much. In fact, I'll name my first son after you. Uncle, <laughs> <laughs> God bless you. Now, here. Yeah. Hey. That is 10,000 naira. Add it to the 20,000 naira your in law gave you. And uh, you go back to your business in the city with it. Hey! Chimo. Mbam. Mbam. Jim, 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 Jim. I never get my name, Mazo. Hey, I never see the Lord. Thank you very much. Hey, Rebecca, I'm going to do. Rebecca, I'm going to do. So, Rebecca, I'm going to do. Rebecca, I'm going to do. Thank God. Thank you very much. Thank you. Mama, help me to thank Uncle. I will. Uncle, thank you very much. God bless you. God bless you too. Yeah. Unless you've tried though. Mm, thank God. Oh. Uh, Nana, go and get me a very cold bottle of beer. All right. Let me join this celebration. Oh. And 
I uh, will need to eat over to you. Make me over. Yeah. Rebecca will do that. Woman. Woman, here are the items. This is a family. <laughs> This. Nine. Here is 30,000 naira, 20,000 for the items, and 10,000 for your labor. <laughs> you! What about the body of 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 the and you are endowed to punish this innocent woman. Nay, in fact, I have no sympathy for her. She's a witch. <laughs> My ancestors, my hands are clean. Rebecca, I'm a trade bro. May the consequences of this be upon your head. And upon all my generations to come. So be it. Rebecca, stretch your fourth right hand and call her by them four times. Chidema. 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 Nancy. Rebecca. Oh, Gojo. Kelaba. It's very hot. Put her here. <laughs> I've seen you here. Whether this bottle is cocked or open, there will be no way out for you. <laughs> Woman, let me have that red oil. From henceforth, may you become a leper and may leprosy affect you. May you get rotten alive. I have decreed. Mama, oh, give me. No. The papers 
Caution! You don't want to go. In Kechi! In Kechi! Bring for all you! Crashing her. Her body? Yes, Auntie. And that you should please come with me. So fast? Um, okay, okay. Uh, just go. I'll come with you. Okay, Auntie. <laughs> hmm. Foolish people. This is just the beginning. No, 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 no. It's yours. I'll get you. Oh my God! Mm -hmm. Look at that, she's all over her body. No. Mm -mm. Mama Chidema, what's the meaning of this? I don't know. Uh -uh. Mama, sorry. It might be chicken pox. So. How can? Is it rheumatism? Hey, Ikechi, what is it? Scratching me. Good to go office. Go, go. He tell him to bring his guy immediately. Um, Ernest will be in the office now. He traveled away with the chairman. Oh. Unless Ikechi will give it a trial. In you know, was Ikechi run to the market square. Get your card out. Right. <clears throat> Sorry, yeah? Uh -huh. Sorry. Sorry. Bring your leg. Bring it. Mama, sorry. Uh, try, try. Bring it. Bring your leg. Try. Mm. Sorry, sorry. Take it easy. Take it easy. Is it yeah! Oh. Sorry, yeah? Mm -hmm. Sorry. Easy. My mother be alright. I hope nothing serious is wrong with her. My dear, do you know God? Yes, I do. Then pray. Doctor. Aha, uh -huh. Honorable. Yes. I've been waiting for you. Okay. Uh, Nina, uh, go back to the room upstairs. I'll be with your mother. I'll join you soon. I've been waiting for you. You see, I've confirmed that she has the boss. A very chronic one like that. And I have my fears whether she could be cured. My question is, can leprosy just occur like that? Well, in my years of uh, medical practice, I've never encountered a situation like this. So, what do I do? This woman is a very responsible, hardworking, virtuous woman. I can spend any money on her. She's my late brother's wife. Okay? I mean, in my lineage, there's been no mention of leprosy, so you can't start now. Uh, there's always a first time. Do her sickness baffles me. And as I defined all medical uh, expertise. So what do I do now? Well, maybe you try an alternative uh, medicine. But I advise medically. Don't waste your money. Good luck. Okay. Mama and Enna. Sorry, eh? You'll be fine, okay? Sorry. I want to bring her uh, Nani mother again. Nana, has your mother eaten anything? No. The little pup she took, she tripped up. Oh, Joe. Come the water. 
The evil one shall not see me. Oh, oh Ju. Hmm. Madam, what has my husband do? Um, he went to the office. Is there any problem online? He's commenced treatment. He gave me enough money in case if he demand for any. Hmm. Oh, Ju. The woman. Take her to the veranda. Ikechi, mm. mm. bring her up, eh? Oju. I don't know what my swan. I'm going to go back and bring no monk. The food. Does not know where and when sacrilege was committed. Nani Madeke, administer the drugs, eh? Please, you're wasting time. When I go back, they look one matumia. What that drabble of womia? Oh, Jew. If I want to go to the other man, Kiriko, when I got one meal, I tell you, I in fact, I will not, and I shall never be a party to this. Chidemu, Chidemu, if I were you. Nani Madeke. What is the meaning of this? Nani Madeke. Anambe. Nani Madeke. Oju. Nani, please. Uh -uh. Nani, come and treat her. Eh? Oju. Nani, please come back. Nani Madeke. What's Nani, the please, problem? Now. Eh? Auntie, please beg him. Auntie, please. Mama. Hey. Oh, you! I was rushing to meet you at home. Uh, how did it go? And I said, I'm sorry. I will never be a party to, to the treatment of a woman who defied the land and the gods turned against her. How do you mean? Oh, you! That man is evil. We would have been dead by now. Dead? What would have killed me? Chidemman, Kahima. Chidemman. Oh, you! No, I don't believe you. I don't want you to believe me. You should stay clear of her. In fact, that woman was coming back from the shrine where he was to prepare a love portion for you before leprosy struck her. Chidema. Uju. Prepare a love portion for me. Don't doubt it, too, because if you, if you do, Uju is again on Allah. Okay? Uju. No, um, no, I will send a message across to your house. Yeah, no. thank you. You know, yeah? yes. 
Where did you go? Go to Julu. It's by going to a little shrine for me. What have I done to you? What is the word to pay back? May the gods judge you today and forever. Uncle, don't let two ears hear this now. It's an abomination. Mama, if what Uncle is saying is true, what led you to do such a thing? And I did him. Me? She didn't. Mind. Did what? Hey. Hey. Am I ending? Are you ready, Emma? Am I ending? Oh, please stop the girl. Are you dead forever? Oh. What did I not give you? I can't do it. Did you ever want anything? The things I kept for my wife, I revealed to you. And yet you had a mind to go to a little shrine for me? May the gods reward you today and forever. Oh, 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 please, no. Oh, please, no. Oh, please, no. Oh, please, no. It's not true. Oh, please, no. Oh, please, no. Oh, please, no. Oh, please, no. <laughs> um, Ernest, please better go to Chinema's house and so stop bothering me here. What did I eat and not give this woman? Where have I offended her? <laughs> The reward I get is an attempt to eliminate me. Is she no longer your idea of a woman? Oh, you have even agreed to marry her. Hey, she went for love potion, eh? <laughs> Hi, my God is alive, oh. What a sweet reward. I was through that witch out of this Eh! Mind you, you can't force Chidema out of this compound. After all, she's living in her own husband's house. You can't force her out. And I'm still in this compound with the leper. No. Anyway, do that at your own risk. At worst, I'll run back to my parents. <laughs> Every day she's this, she's that, respectful and all that. She's no longer your idea of a woman. <laughs> Sweetheart, what is this that I'm saying? Honey, that's the way we saw it. Mama just developed leprosy overnight. <laughs> Mama, how did it happen? My son. Mm -hmm. See me. See what is left of me. She didn't. The lioness. Why did you go? When I was in the kitchen preparing food, even Lena was there with me. All of a sudden, I started feeling her sensation inside me. Immediately. My whole body, I mean from my head to toe. Started scratching me. As a result of. Mama. <sighs> Mama, why must it be now? Just two days. Two days to our traditional wedding. It's a lie. The devil is a liar. And he is a liar and will ever remain a liar. Mama. I must take you to a good hospital in the city. Yes. I appreciate. <sighs> Sweet. 
sweetheart. This is 20,000 naira. Use it for her upkeep. I may be back tomorrow. Okay? Yeah. yeah. How are you? I'm fine. Have you been to the house already? Uh, yes. I went to see my mother-in-law to be. They sent Ikechi to me yesterday. Hi. Yeah. Actually, I'm waiting for a friend of mine here. Okay. Because we're going somewhere. It's okay. Um, Zubi. Yeah. Um, you see. This Chidema's sickness. I've seen things in my life, but her sickness, I mean, I don't know what to say about that one. <sighs> my dear, this is real bad luck for Nenna and myself. Just two days. Two days to our traditional wedding. <sighs> uh, nevertheless, I'll rush her to a good hospital in the city. Ah. Um, do you think that would be necessary? Oh, very necessary. She needs to be treated of uh, the sickness. And I feel a good doctor can handle the case. Um, you see, Zubi, uh -huh. I don't mean to discourage you, okay? But as a young man, you need to be very, very careful not to involve yourself into a spiritual warfare capable of destroying your future. Spiritual warfare? What exactly do you mean? You see, Chidema's sickness is caused by the gods of the land. She offended the gods and the sickness is the outcome of her evil. Gods of the land? Yes. How did she offend the gods? Like I heard, she went to a native doctor to get a charm against my husband. Then on her way back with the charm, disaster occurred. What? Your own husband? Ernest, the one you know. Such a nice man. For what? I don't know. I don't know. <sighs> Thank God this happened now that I have not been deeply involved. Yes. Um, yes. um Zubi. But that shouldn't stop you from marrying a Nena. Nana is a very, very good girl. It shouldn't stop you. Thanks for your good advice. Thank you very much. I'll see you later. Eh? Hey. Will you still get to the house? Mm. Until I get home first. All right, but please, Zubi, just take it easy. It's take okay. it easy. Everything will be all right. It's all right. Uh, my regards to your husband, okay? I will. I will. Yeah. Want to try me? <laughs> anyway, let me go. Home. Sweetheart, what is this that I'm seeing? Honey, that's the way we saw it. Mama just developed leprosy overnight. <laughs> Mama, how did it happen? My son. <laughs> See me. See what is left of me. Chidim. The lioness. Why the egg When I was in the kitchen preparing food, even Nena was there with me. All of a sudden, I started feeling her sensation inside me. Immediately, my whole body, I mean from my head to toe, started scratching me. As a result of... Mama. Then, um... <sighs> Mama, why must it be now? Just two days. 
two days to our traditional wedding. It's a lie. The devil is a liar. Nani, he is a liar and will ever remain a liar. Mama, I must take you to a good hospital in the city. Yes. I appreciate it. Sweetheart, this is 20,000 naira. Use it for her upkeep. I may be back tomorrow. Okay? Thank you. You're welcome. But why don't you take her to the hospital immediately? Uh, I have to go home and cancel the wedding. You know, all my people are prepared. God. My son. This is unimaginable. Please bear with me. Tell your people to bear with us. I'll be very, very soon. There's no trouble. It's alright. No trouble. It's well. Zulu, I send my greetings to your parents. I swear. It's You're well. welcome. You are here. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. How are you? I'm fine. Uh, have you been to the house already? Uh, yes. I went to see my mother-in-law to be. They sent EKG to me yesterday. Uh, yeah. Actually, I, I'm waiting for a friend of mine here. Okay. Because we're going somewhere. It's okay. Um, Zubi. Yeah. Um. This Chidema's sickness. I've seen things in my life, but her sickness, her name. I don't know what to say about that one. <sighs> my dear, this is real bad luck for Nenna and myself. Just two days. Two days to our traditional wedding. <sighs> uh, nevertheless, I'll rush her to a good hospital in the city. Ah. Um, do you think that would be necessary? Oh, very necessary. She needs to be treated of uh, the sickness. And I feel a good doctor can handle the case. Um, you see, Zubi, uh -huh. I don't mean to discourage you, okay? But as a young man, you need to be very, very careful not to involve yourself into a spiritual warfare capable of destroying your future. Spiritual warfare? What exactly do you mean? You see, Chidema's sickness is caused by the gods of the land. She offended the gods and the sickness is the outcome of her evil. Gods of the land? Yes. How did she offend the gods? Like I heard, she went to a native doctor to get a charm against my husband. Then on her way back with the charm, disaster occurred. What? Your old husband? Ennis, the one you know. Such a nice man. For what? I don't know. I don't know. <sighs> Thank God this happened now that I have not been deeply involved. Yes. Um, yes. um Zubi. But that shouldn't stop you from marrying and Nena. Nana is a very, very good girl. Yeah, it shouldn't stop you. Thanks for your good advice. Thank you very much. I'll see you later. Eh? Hey. Oh, no, no. Will you still get to the house? Mm. Until I get home first. All right, but please, Zubi, just take it easy. It's take okay. it easy. Everything will be all right. It's all right. Uh, my regards to your husband, okay? I will. I will. Yeah. Want to try me? <laughs> anyway, 
Kamusta ni Gohi? Mm -hmm. What a frame up. Rebecca Mwedi, did you believe your husband? Mama Nenda, I've tried to come, but he wouldn't listen. He even threatens to throw me out of the house should I continue to disturb him. Auntie, please don't quarrel with Uncle because of Mama. Hmm. God is not asleep. The truth will someday be told. Amen. It may take some time, but definitely it must be revealed. Uh -huh, that reminds me. Nena, what of Zubi? He was here last week and promised to take Mama to the hospital. But we are here to see him. Meaning what? Is that how he wants to be our in-law? Maybe he traveled out. Zubi never disappoints. Shut up your mouth! Is it when your mother dies that we'll be here? That's why I hate all these all these stringon boys of nowadays. Nothing will happen to my mother. Shut up your mouth! Nothing will happen to her. Make sure first thing tomorrow morning you get back to the city and find out what he's doing there. I can't leave Mama now. I, I can't leave her in this condition. Zubi will come. I said shut up! Were you the one taking care of her when you were in the school? Am I not going to take care of her? I'm sorry. No, am I not going to take care of you? Make sure you go there tomorrow morning and find out what he's doing. All these stupid chingon boys. Stupid things. Mama, are you sure you can manage? Mm -hmm. I will, my daughter. Nena, go to the city and see Zubi. You go to your school as well and know whether you have started the exams. Hmm? Your future is more important. Do I go to Kechi's master and ask him to release him? Mm -mm. Don't bother him. Allow him to do his business. Rebecca will help me. If you're sure. I'll be leaving tomorrow morning. Except the exams are started, I'll only stay for this. Mm. Nana, think less about me. I'm having leprosy, nothing more. And if you can see, I think I can take care of myself. Me, Papa. Ma. And I'm not. Mama. Mm -hmm. Let me go and see Adora and collect something from her. Right. Me, Papa. Ma. Sumi, do you know you are blessed with such a wonderful woman? And here is a welcome lunch. Really? Welcome back, lunch. <laughs> now, Michael. Yeah. Uh, Mama's illness has affected my girl so badly. Hey, that's bad. Okay. Jesus wept. Zubi, what is that? Judge, 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 judge. Take a look at this. Nina, come here. Yes, honey's. Any trouble? For heaven's sake, what kind of nonsense soup is this? Honey, this is the mono soup that he asked me to prepare. What kind of mono soup is this black? No oil, no vegetable, full of pepper, tasteless. Oh my god, my friend, what? what's all this noise for? You have not even tasted the food and you are ranting up and down that is black and it is tasteless. Honey, I mean, this is how a mono soup is. Oh, made. get out from here. Uh, Mike, please. Eat if you care. For me, I don't want to eat poison. Honey, my own food poison.
Mm. Zubi. This is delicious. It's delicious. I'm telling you. Just try. It's really delicious. I need some money. I spent the last time on me in the village. And how does that consign me? Subi. That's me? Do you realize you're talking to me, Nen? And even if I do, and so what? You want me to fear you? Are you a masquerade? If I may ask. Me, please. I just need some money. You know I don't have an alternative. You better do. You better do. See me. I don't want to attract the wrath of your village gods. Zubi, how? What do you mean by that? What exactly are you driving at? Receive any sad news from home. Eh? Eh? Anyway, anyway, sweetheart, share the problem with me. I could be of help. Anyway, don't wear your emotions down. Remember, exam starts in three days' time. You can lean on me. Go ahead, talk to me. Talk to me. Amaka. Amaka. I'm hearing you. The whole world is crashing down on me. What is my sin? <laughs> what if not said what the problem is? Talk to me now. Amaka. Amaka. Sumi is killing me. So I so I so Does his change of attitude have anything to do with my mother's illness? He didn't tell me that. How can? Uh, because he said he doesn't want to incur the wrath of my village gods. Am I now a murderer? No, you're not. You see, this is also one of the things I must find out from Zubi. Okay? Mm. If Zubi really said that, it is indeed an erroneous statement. Meanwhile, I run to lecture. Okay? All right. I'll get back to you. Thank you very much.
Ernest, <coughs> we have eaten your cola. Now tell us why you call for this meeting. My elders, I greet you. My reason for calling for this meeting is very simple. I can no longer continue to stay in this compound with this leper. Honest, Eden, we are the one to take these children to. Why, Bichon, Jello, we are here. Um, Ernest, tell us why she will stay here again. Simple. She's a leper and she's a witch. I cannot afford to be infected by her witchcraft and leprosy. Myself and my wife. Chineke me. Hey. Hey. Woman, if you don't keep quiet, we will leave. Hey. Why is it that you women nowadays have no regard for elders? It's when you say that we are here and we are here. Um, Ito, calm down. <clears throat> hmm? Calm down. Let's talk this over. Huh? Um, Ernest, we have had your reasons. Now tell us, how did you know that Chidema is a witch? Of, of course I know. Ozuronye. Ozuronye, that question is irrelevant. He who wears the shoe knows what it pinches. So let's face the fact. Chidema must leave his place and she must go. And what must that happen in this family? Where I am the eldest uncle. Eh? Nan, Ernest, I asked you again. Who told you that Chidema is a witch? Why should I tell you who told me? As a counselor of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, I know my rights. You have no local standard to ask me who told me. She must leave this compound, and that's simple. And I said she won't. I said she won't. Now, and if I must dig deeper, you must answer for the uh, 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 for the cause of Chidema's uh, leprosy infection. You are this your body wife. Are you called those women or what? Never you associate my name with any ungodly thing. I will damn the consequences and spit on your face if you ever try that again. Rebecca. Rubbish. Rebecca, will you shut up your mouth? So you have gotten the mouth to challenge the dreaded Ozilonia. If you dare open this here, dirty mouth, eh? I will call the use of this time to deal with you. No, you don't. That cannot happen. I will never allow you to call the youths. You have no right. I have the powers. Has any of you here had a handshake with a president? Mm -hmm. eh? You don't know the powers I have as a counselor of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. Ernest. You don't know. Ernest, he who goes with faces on his buttocks must be prepared to dance with the flies. And let me tell you, if you try anything funny, you will see what will happen to you. You will see what will happen to you. They will not have Let us go. Okay. Let us go. Yes, I don't want to take this rubbish again. Oh, None of you has been to Asoro. I have had a handshake with the president. I can use that handshake. It's my authority. I will invoke my powers. Michael, I told you anything about Nen, I don't want to hear it again. Please, don't spoil my day because... Hey, Subi, please, Subi, for God's sake. Subi, even if Nen is born of a chimpanzee, she doesn't deserve this harsh and inhuman treatment you are giving her. Simply because she loves you so much, Subi. Mike, let me tell you one thing you don't know. Nena would have earned more respect from me if she were born of a chimpanzee. My God, Subi. So, did you know you are referring to a woman you would have waited some few weeks back, if not for the mother's illness? <laughs> and because God loves me, he put the obstacle. If that wedding had come true, <laughs> who knows, I may have become a history now. Dead? Of course! How do you mean? <laughs> you see, things of the spirit is revealed to men like us. But you, carnally minded people, see the physical. My friend, shut up there. Look at you and spirit. You just had a hangover last night. Of course, I am proud of it. Because our own Jesus Christ turned water into shine shine bubble in Galilee. Come, let's go and kick that shine shine bubble. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> if you like, go and bribe Uzronye. 
Give him all you have an entire community. But what I tell you is, if you don't leave this compound, I'll burn this whole place down. Ernest, you can never intimidate me. I'm in my husband's house, and this is his own portion. Which husband? Ernest, go to your house. Leave my husband's house for me. Go to your house, Ernest. No, see how the mouth to talk about your husband's house. Who knows how he died? You may have killed him mysteriously with your witchcraft. It's your wife, Rebecca, that is a witch. What? <laughs> it's your mother-in-law that is a witch. Rebecca, your mother is a witch. Me, a witch. Look at this leper. He's like, you're, you're not a witch. Don't touch her, don't touch her. Oh, she will infect you with this. Witch, wicked woman, you soon die. I'm bringing a cane. I'm cane her very well. I will flog the living daylight out of you. <laughs> Devil! Devil! That's it, Lapa Yebisunona. That is around the corner. You still die. Agabus. It is you who is Agabus. You are Agabus. Aka Yebisunona. Witchy. You're a witch. Agabus. Aka Yebisunona. On a good day. And then, as you can see, I'm on my way out. What would I do for you? I just want us to discuss something. Concerning your reports to all my friends against me? Hmm? Come on, Nena. Common sense would have told you that I'm no longer interested in the relationship. Zubi, so you're joking. You know what you mean to me. My life. My hope and future. Nena, get this into your block brain. Everything I felt for you that moved me into thinking of settling down with you is over. So you go out there, look for a man who is ready to live with the daughter of a witch. Sumi! Sumi, what did you just call me? You heard me right. I would rather date a lady in Bessa than to live with the daughter of a diabolical woman. Good day. Why should you be crying over a spell milk? You can do it without Zubi. Just, just believe in yourself. Amaka. Amaka, why me? My whole world is spinning around. Look at my mother. Life is full of ups and downs. You're my closest friend here in school. You are aware that I'm a divorcee. Yet I push along. Leaving all the pleasures, leisures, and affluence of my ex-husband's home. Here I am now. Dear for my dear. Borrow away from me and adjust your life. Huh? Stop this damage you are doing to yourself. Stop it. Tears can never change anything. It cannot. Huh? Maka, thank you. It's okay, Nina. Thank you very much. But I will not give up this fight. I know the enemy wants to destroy our household. But God will rescue us! It's alright! It's alright! Ah! It's okay! Are you going to the revision class with me? That revision class can wait till I sort myself out. Please yourself. But remember, a broken heart never mends.
to say to you. Go, 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 Betty I Pig. I was just trying go, to... Go, 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 go. Go, I say go. Betty Pig. Go. Go. Madam, I am not I am not I am not I am I am not I am not I am I am not I am not I am in short, I'm not going to sell to you. Aboku? Mm. Uh, Nenkali. Uh, have you had any quarrel before? How are you talking to me? Eh? Uh, 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 do I look like a dirty pig? Uh, <laughs> you are right. You are right, my dear. Even the pigs are more decent than you. Now tell me, after putting that contaminated hand of yours inside this gary, who will buy it again? I say, who will buy it? Nenkali. Is sickness now a cause? Mm. You are still taking it as an ordinary sickness. If you don't know, my dear. Yours is a severe cause. As a price of your witchcraft atrocities. You are a witch. Your mother is also a witch. I join him. Okay. You are just exhibiting the evil in you. What other evidence do one need to prove your wickedness? Okay, hey, now I know. Rebecca was right to... Hey! Oh, so Rebecca is now going about gossiping with my name. Okay? God must reward all of you. Okay? God will first reward you. Anyway, you are being rewarded. Eh? Idiot. Just take a look at yourself. Nonsense. Smelling like a curse while alive. Woman. Come on, let me see you around this table again. A riffraff. I say, let me see you here again. I'll give you a touch of it. Embarrassment and interrogation is this. Excuse me. Where do you think you're going? You pick and drop daughter of a label? Shimo! Eh? Stop, 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 stop! Nana! So you've broken my center table! You daughter of a witch! Go in my house! Why right, come on, go! Go, go! Fucking out! Fucking what's that? Out! 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 Stop me! Out! Move! I said go! Come and fight me. Husband snatcher. Go Come on out! I can kill and bury you without anybody asking after you. Zubi! You daughter of a witch like mother like daughter Zubi what is this what is this Zubi what's going on here Zubi you should be ashamed of yourself look at you keeping yourself busy by beating up a woman Zubi you should be ashamed of yourself you should Michael. be ashamed of yourself Michael Zubi. if not for the fact that we are friends I would have disgraced you right how will you disgrace me Zubi how just because I stopped you from committing murder eh <laughs> Zubi I cannot see that you are a fool and you're a big one at that. Me? Michael, get out of this place with this blood sucker. It is your sister that is a blood sucker. You fuck me. I won't stay here and watch you touch this lady again. Okay? Come on, try it. Let me see. Try it. Let's see. 
Nana, come, let me go and drop you. Don't mind this, your shameless boyfriend. Michael! Subi, you Now, let me tell you, Subi! The day the tiger will see the hunter with the gun, he takes to his heels. Zubi, you are not a tiger. Neither do you have any tail. Okay? <laughs> but I'll make sure you regret this, Zubi. <laughs> Is that a threat or what? Is that a threat? You cannot threaten a chameleon with colors because chameleon itself is a matter of colors. Idiot. Nena, I've told you I'm just the head of department and not dean of faculty or dean student affairs. Just go pay your school and departmental fees and sit for the examinations, period. I understand, sir. But the dean said I'll be allowed to take my exams. If you can vouch that, I'll pay later. Just a written note from you solves the problem. See, Nena, I don't know you will ever cross my path again. How much more coming to ask for my assistance after you turn down my offer to go out with me? Sir, please. Please remember God. Uh, I, I was only trying to obey his commandment not Shut to come out. Are you a virgin? You want to tell me you have no boyfriend in the campus? Nena. Why not release your body to me? I, I, I would rather repeat this semester than, than sleep around with lecturers for favor. In that case, I'm going to frustrate you. You leave not to graduate as long as I remain the head of the department. Now, leave my house. Sir, you're not going to leave my house, you child. Sculpture in this campus. Every lecturer is after my body. I'm just coming from the head of this house and he still insists I sleep with him before he can help me. What kind of life is this now? Nay. Nee. These things are trials in life. I want you to understand that any problem that comes to a man is a visitor. And it's bound to go someday. So be courageous. Be courageous, my dear. Maka, tell me. Is it without the cause of all this? Is it a crime to fall in love? Look at my poor mother, let me should be the village as a leper. Nena, relax yourself. Love is a dangerous game, you know. It's either you lose or you win. The main issue now is how you can possibly take your exams. How else but money? Don't worry, God is in control. Hmm? God is in control. Don't be too hard on yourself. Hmm? My baby, don't be hard on yourself. Hmm? God is in control of everything. Um, Nana, it is regretful that I have to do this. So please, go home with your brother, Ikechi. Anytime your mother settles her differences, 
with Honorable Ernest. Then he can come back. Please. But, sir, I haven't done anything to deserve this. Please, my dear, I know. You have not done anything to deserve this. You will not understand. But, sir, I obeyed you. You obeyed me. You will not understand the pressure I'm receiving from your uncle. Eh? Okay, wait. Ne, read this. This is from our traditional ruler. On this same matter. Please, I don't want to die young. Chief, Chief, please have mercy. Have mercy on us and retain Ikechi. You know our condition. Where and whom do we run to? My dear, you push you go home. Go home and beg your uncle. He's the cause. I cannot disobey his orders. Remember, he was the one who signed the agreement between I and Ikech on your mother's behalf. And right now, he has withdrawn his guarantee. What do you want me to do? There's nothing I can do. Okay. Please. I want to run to the shop. Chief, please, give us some money. We don't have transport fare. It's okay. The two of you should come. Jack. So you are still here painting? Where is the breakfast I asked for? Baby, breakfast will be ready in 30 minutes time. Let me finish. Do you know it's already past nine? That I must go out for business. Oh baby, business won't run. Huh? Take this life easy. Life, Najeje. Hmm? Besides, I need to look good for you. I don't want any of my competitors to look prettier. You know how much I love you now. I don't want to lose you, baby. Oh, stop that. Jen, you know you're very lazy. <laughs> and so? Are you just finding out? You should have known I'm a princess. And Zubi, let me warn you. Let this be the very last time you will ever pass this kind of remark on me. Nonsense. So, if you go grow through out, because Ernest withdrew his guarantee. You are not only that. Uncle Ernest even instructed His Royal Highness to write a warning letter to him. So the man had no other option than to throw me out. Hmm. So Ernest could be this wicked. Mama, hmm? tell us the truth. Are you a witch? My children, ever since we lived together in this house, have you suspected me for any devilish act? Or have I ever done one? Mama, you owe us the duty of telling us the truth. We are your children. We are the only ones that can stand by you. Mama. The earlier you tell us the truth, better for us. I swear by the grave of my husband, Demerem, if I have ever put my hand in any evil act, may I not survive this sickness. But if I have not, may God vindicate me. Why are you doing this to us? Your own blood! Uncle, please have mercy! 
first of all, go and talk to your mother. She's the cause of everything. If not the way I'm begging my husband, he would have thrown her out of this compound. <laughs> Uncle, please remember our father. <laughs> Can't you forgive mama for his sake? Forgive a woman who wished me dead? That's impossible. <laughs> go and ask your mother to give you money. Also tell her to go and beg Ikechi's master to take him back. Uncle, please. Auntie, please. No. <laughs> Get out of here! Get out! 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 I want us to rob minds together. We women, we know ourselves. Mama, I want you to tell me in confidence as your daughter, the whole truth. Did you in any way try to kill Uncle Ernest? Nena, my daughter. Huh? I can never live to jeopardize the future of my children. In fact, not on my grief. It's just that I'm curious because of these calamities that are befalling us, your children. As I'm talking to you now, I'm no longer with Subi. Mm -hmm. He dumped me because of you. Huh? And you already know Ikechi's story. I just don't know. I don't know. My daughter, this is my holy Bible. This is the word of God. I have never in my life thought of killing, not to talk about honesty, Dim. The only husband that I'm seeing today. Mbano. Mother Virgin Mary is my witness. Uncle, as we are talking to you now, we've tried to make Mama tell us if she ever attempted to kill Uncle Ernest. But she insisted her hands were clean. Uncle, Mama had better say the truth. I can't stay in this village with her anymore. I can't. Well, Nana, Uncle. and the kitchen, my children, Uncle. I would beg you to hold your peace for now. Eh? Hold your peace. Uh, as an elder, I have used my elderly eyes to see that there is a mix up somewhere. And uh, who knows, your mother may be saying the truth. Could they maybe miss a ban of your book? Uncle agreed. But please, talk to Mama. Let her beg Uncle Ernest, so peace can reign in the house. Uncle, just a simple begging, just a simple begging. That shows that both of you are intelligent. Hmm? And I assure you, I will do that. Hmm? I will do that. Uncle, thank you. Uncle, mm -hmm. thank you. Meanwhile, I'm on my way for the meeting before you came in. Okay. Eh? I will see you when I come back. Greet your mother for me. Right. Uh -huh. Thank you very much. Uh -huh. Thank you. Uh -huh. I'm going out to make sure I'm on the door. A walk in a camerake. Unye di mo ole ye mereke. E honanya morogi kam jiri baswegi we. E honani le mereke. Ke weri hojo kwa mo. Are you mad? Is that not your God? Mom, enough. Enough. Look at the terrible condition your wickedness has put us into. Yet you show no remorse. Don't make me believe you're a witch. Oh. witch. Oh, who is a witch? No, no. You are not worthy to be my daughter. Is it because of this temporary setback? If you try this again, I'll stop and nothing is dealing with you. You are calling by my name. Sister, why not deal with her? Imagine, we are suffering because of your misdeed. Yet, we are unrepentant. Ikechi, even you. Yes. Mama, you have dug your own grave. From henceforth, you are on your own. Yes. It is because of you that I lost my fiancé. Because of the same you, Ikechi's master sent him out of his house. And now, uncle, to hell with you and your uncle. Eh. You can go to blazes. I don't. Uncle, 
Kichi and I are here to tell you that we don't have anything to do with cheating me again. We exonerate ourselves from her wickedness and witchcraft. Uncle, she's on her own. We must pursue our future. Mama is unrepentant. <coughs> Wise decision. Honey, you can have them now. I thought you both were supporting your mother. Uncle, she's no longer our mother. Okay. Ikeji, go and get ready. You're going back to your master. And you, Nana, you're going back to school. Go and get ready. Do as your uncle has said. He will give you all the needed financial assistance. When you're ready, Ikeji, I'll give you a letter to your master. And you, Nana, I'll give you money to go back to school. Go and get ready. Uncle, thank you. Uncle, thank you so much. Auntie, thank you. She wants to rule the world. Oh. Her name is authority. Everybody knows power. She has the final say. She wants to rule the world. Oh. Her name is authority. Everybody must bow. She has the final say. She wants to rule the world. Show them man. What's happening to you? Show them talking to you. What is it? No, yes, Unless and his wife have finished me. <laughs> they deceive my children into denying me. How do you mean? <laughs> children, my dog, I said, how do you mean? I never told my children that no one who children me is a witch. That if they don't avoid me, their lives are at stake. So, Nana Nikaji walked out of me. To the house. Mm. I will come and sort it out. No. Mm. You said I should go back to the no. house. Go back to your house. I will come and sort it out. No, I can't wait to see you. I said I will come. I will come. No. Just go. I will come. has anything to do with Zubi, both of them can go to hell and burn to ashes. If Zubi has repented, what's your own? Mm. Eh? You know, every man that is born of a woman is polygamous in nature. Zubi might only want to have a change of babe. Because any change of babe brings about a fresh excitement. excitement. Yes, come in if you're good looking. Hello girls. Mm. No, I can't believe this is you. My good day. Hmm. The word Mike. Good day. Good day. We didn't hear the sound of your car. <laughs> exactly, girls. I wanted to sneak in on you girls. See, I was informed by your hostel mate that Ne is back. So. So? Never mind, never mind. Ne, why didn't you inform me you were traveling? Something that required my urgent attention came up, so I had no other alternative than... To leave without any information? It's okay, but can I talk to you privately? Mm -mm. Hold on. I will excuse you guys. Mm? So, Ne. Thank you. Moraya Kazu, just shine me. your eye. Trust me. Maka sim babe na so. Let me go and share some things. Maka sim the baby. Maka sim. Oh, yeah? Come on, 
insult me? What nonsense is this, eh? Am I the only person in this life? Nay, no, you're not cursed, okay? You're not. It's far from that. Listen to me, Nena. In you, I find my ideal wife, my sister, and my mother. Mike, will you get out of this room? Nay, no, listen to me, please. How I wish you can un understand how I feel for you. What I feel is real. Mike, I said what? To please you, I'll go for now, okay? But God knows you're mine forever. I'll be seeing you, honey. Hey, how I feel that I get out! No sense! What kind of nonsense is this, huh? See, Mike. into his approach. Who knows how what? Not that I'll be married to a man who spent just got me like a piece of dirty rag. That I'll be married to a man who eats and dies with my ex fiancé Who knows if this is their plan to let me up the law? God! God, why am I not in this? Nah. Stop crying. Let's put all this in prayer. May the will of God be done. Amaka. Amaka, you can pray if you like. I am not interested. Mm. It's God not seeing my afflictions. Yes, it keeps quiet. Oh. Can we not go for our lectures? Amaka. Amaka, leave me here. I am not interested. What's the use? What's the need really? This is a toast to my sunshine and for a long lasting relationship. Hope there's this game I want to show people how to play. Mm -hmm. Yeah, people. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You and then the first one to you. Mm -hmm. You stand there. And you you can back back with you. Please keep your eyes closed, both of you. Huh? Keep your eyes closed. Mm -hmm. Keep your eyes closed. Keep your eyes closed. Okay. Michael. Hey! Excuse Michael! Me. Before your best friend, Amaka, would you marry me? You do, you do, you do. Thank you. the one that I'm greeting. And as I have decided not to respond to your demonic greetings, what happens? Eh? Rebecca, I see Nambogi. 
If I were you, I would have asked my God many questions. Look at the lepers you're talking. Eh? You and I, who should ask God questions? Eh? Already you are harvesting your evil manipulations. Wicked woman. Rebecca, are you not ashamed? Your conspiracy has been unveiled. Rebecca, just have a look at yourself. In the whole community, you are in enmity with everybody. Rebecca, still you parade yourself like a peacock. Just be parading like this. Rebecca, my life must be better than yours. Oh, is that your plan? Eh? Is that your plan? Then let's see who wins. Yeah, Chidema. What are you doing with my bucket? Or do you now want to infest me with your leprosy? Give me that one. Rebecca! Foolish woman. Must I ask your permission before using your bucket? Rebecca, you always use my you know. You always use my bucket. Everybody must bow. She has the final say. She wants to rule the world. Her name is authority. Everybody must bow. She has the final say. She wants to rule the world. Her name is authority. Hey, sugar baby. I'm pretty dark. You know, I want to have my kids approved. Once I am pregnant, straight to US. Hmm? I don't want to have any of my kids. I want them to be American citizens. Sounds nice. That's a very good idea. Uh, what if I am unable to afford the necessary finance? Then you should have a rethink. There is no need starting what you cannot finish. Meaning that we shouldn't get married after all? No, now. So you don't have the plans of becoming richer as you are? Well, riches, as far as I'm concerned, is not a product of struggle or something. It's just a gift from God. <laughs> then you should ask all the successful men how they got their riches. Then do it and become rich. Huh? Poverty is a curse. Or don't you know? Maybe I should ask your father what he did. Baby, you are becoming rude lately. Why? Why my father? Because your father is a successful businessman. Is he not? Oh, Zubi, please spare me that. Be warned. My father is neither in your class nor your age. Let this be the last time you will ever repeat this. Nonsense. Uh, that word nonsense, I hate it. And let it not come out of your mouth again. Hey. Zubi, do you know you're a shameless man? Huh? I asked you for common 30,000 naira for my cosmetics. And you shamelessly give me this miserable 10,000 naira. Huh? A while ago, you were insulting my father. Now, on this, Zubi, are you mad? Why have you resorted to insulting me? Don't you know I'm a princess? <laughs> princess. Princess of which kingdom? Princess of animal kingdom or human kingdom? Now, get this into your stupid brain. All the while I was staying with Nena, I never gave her anything more than 1,000 Naira for her cosmetics. And she was always grateful. So, be warned, because I will no longer condone this, your intransigent and recalcitrant attitude. <laughs> Is that okay? <laughs> Zubi. Don't you know my social status before you run after me? Are you mad? So you fearlessly threw this money on me? Hey. Hey, Jen. Look, let me tell you. 
Zubi, I don't take nonsense from any man. Eh? You had better go to my neighborhood and ask questions about me. <laughs> when the elephant claims to be the king of the jungle, then other animals will celebrate his burial. Meaning? That pride goes before a fall. Did you hear that? <laughs> Zubi, make up this money for my cosmetics. I want to buy my cosmetics first thing tomorrow morning. Zubi, better make up this money. I want to buy my cosmetics first thing tomorrow morning. Zubi, I'm talking to you. Somebody help me. Oh. Are you mad? Rebecca, please. Oh. Why can't we have peace in this family? Oh my God. Are you the only sick one in this village? What? Rebecca, please, you should forgive me. Oh. Get up and challenge me. Mm -mm. You cursed woman. Mm -hmm. Please call your husband and take me to the hospital. I should tell my husband to take you to the hospital. Mm. Listen, if NS ever touches you again, then I'll cease to be his wife. Please, Rebecca, please, I don't want to die. You are a fool. You are a fool. And let me tell you, never you ever again in your life engage yourself in a war of gender equality. Fool. Mm. Rebecca, yes, please, I don't want to die because no, I am. Please take me to the hospital. Shut up! Hey, Shut up, Zian, because Zian, no, no. Hey, if you shout there again, I. Anyway. Mama, please, if you should take me to the hospital, no. Come on, shut up, Mama. Hey, 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 please. Hey, hey, oh. hey, 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 I don't want to die, yo. Hey, oh. Hey, oh. Hey, oh. Hey, oh. Hey, oh. Stop there, Zubi! Stop there! Michael! Your game plan is up. You all cheat. Oh! Is that why you were playing the good old solicitor? Zubi! I don't believe in verbal confrontation. If you're a man, Zubi, do your worst. Zubi, you don't men her because you don't love her. And I picked her up because I do. So tell me, friend, what is the reason for your envy? Hmm. Michael, don't doubt my prowess. I can give all if you refuse to leave Nenna for me. Fine, now, get out of my house. Get out. And mind you, Zubi, it's on record that you have threatened my life. The police must surely hear this. So be it. So shall it be, Michael. Let it be on record that I'm giving you just two days, two days for you to leave my wife for me. Else, know it that the battle line is drawn. You can draw the battle line with whatever you want to. I want to die, Zubi, than to leave Nena for a foolish man like you. <laughs> Bet. Now, get out of my house. Get out. Get away. Get out. Get out of my house. Michael, you push me. You cow. Get out. Now listen, from right here, I'm going to report you to all our friends for your information before I begin my action. No, 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 don't bend me, Jen. Now go in there, pack your things, you're leaving my house this moment. Baby, for what have I done to offend you? No, just better keep your mouth shut and do as ordered. Okay? And don't you ever open your mouth as in question again. Please. Because of where I dumped my jewel, my happiness, everything I have, I dumped Nenna because of you. Now go in there and do as ordered. Please, listen to me, you can sort it out, please. Jen, 
I said, go in and pack your things before the count of three. One. Two. But if she, if she can give me this one more chance, I promise that uh, such an incident will never repeat itself. Please. And moreover, if this chance is given, I'm ready to do the traditional wedding even now. Please, Amaka. Zubi, much as I will try to beg Nana here on your behalf, I am not promising or assuring you of accepting you back. Because you hurt her terribly. When you are doing all these things, you didn't call me. You didn't inform me. Now you are kneeling down here begging. Eh? When you are hurting her, you did you see me there? No. No, please. Please. I'm on my knees. Just look inside my eyes, you discover a changed man. Ask of anything, I will do it. I mean, I don't know what came over me. Please. Azubike, that is the door. Use it. We have a quiz in an hour's time and we need to revise. Excuse us. My angel. No, please. Remember the good old days? How we used to be? How we used to play around? I mean, think of the humiliation that I shall be alive and see my best friend, Michael, wed you. It's unbelievable. Azubike, is that your headache? Eh? Is that your headache? Mike is 100 times the man you can never be. Our wedding is taking place overseas and we've concluded all the arrangements. Use that door. Fast. Nonsense. Nena, you mean you insist on marrying Mike? Yes. I will advise you not to start what you cannot finish. Instead of Michael. Instead of you to wed Michael. What will happen? Think about it. What will happen? Think about it. What can you do? I shall be Azubi. back. I shall Come be on, get out! <laughs> get out of here! <laughs> what can you do? You know, a cow never values his step until he loses his feet! Imagine. Nelly. I'm she go mad. No, please. You know how we, you know. <laughs> There's no way I would not stop their wedding. That wedding cannot hold. Never! Frank, don't teach me cowardice. Zubi, please take everything easy as a man. This is why I invited Amaka down here so that we can find a way to resolve this conflict. Just take it as fate as a man. If I were in your shoe, I would allow Nenna and Mike to get married. Please, take it easy as a man. Maybe you and Nena weren't meant for each other. Says who? Says who, Frank, I asked you? A lady I nurtured, trained, sponsored in the university to just go like that? Nowhere. Nowhere. Not when I'm alive. But you cost it. You cost everything. Imagine, you threw away a God-given lady to you. Now you are blaming everybody. Eh? Say, Frank, if this is why you invited me here, then there is nothing I can do. Eh? For God's sake, I am not Nenna. I am not Nenna, and she has the right to make a choice of a man she wants. Is that your stand? Yes. Is that your stand? That is my stand. Okay. I know my onion. No man ever toys with me and goes scot free. You cannot stand on this nose and balance. No way. Imagine Mike betting hands with me because I chose him as a friend. So 
I hope they will wear that, wouldn't they? Sure, sure, sure they will. Then they have got it coming. I shall teach them that the lizard that stops his father's funeral will carry the corpse on his head. Zubi, please take everything easy. Take everything easy as a man. But Amaka, you have to try harder. You have to do something to help us. Okay, I will try. Anas, instead of this Dibia not invoking the offer in this family, let heaven fall. Not here. Not while I'm still alive. By that, you are directly admitting that you are responsible for Chidema's overnight leprosy. Me? You must watch the things you say. I hope you can substantiate what you just said now before our kinsmen. I can prove it even now. I can prove it even now, Ernest. You conspired with this ego to your marriage to punish my late brother's wife. Listen, let me tell both of you. We must bring the offer in this family so that the, the gods will expose the evil doers. Ozronye, I swear we will not allow you to bring your dirty, ungodly deity in this family. Never! Be, 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 be. Rebecca, you open this your dirty mouth and call me by my name, Ozronye. Unless you, you are here. Your wife opened her dirty mouth to call me by my name. Okay. We shall see. But let me tell both of you. This is the Dibia. Must bring it up for here. Not while I'm still alive. What I'm going to do is in this mind. And you will know when the war gong sounds. Ah. Is that what you said? We shall see. Um, Chidema, Chidema, um, let me go and see your medicine man, eh? I will soon be back, eh? E wo gini kamereki, unye di mo ole ihe mereki, e hona nyamorogi kamjiri basuegi we. Can you imagine Osronye enforcing his decisions on me? An ordinary uncle, would he do that if anyone was alive? Why are you complaining? Eh? Tell me, was it not the hand you gave them? Why won't he insult you? Since you cannot reach decision on your own. I will use this case to tell Ozone I am in charge. Ezeribia cannot step with his foot into this compound. And that was the same offer they beat in Amomara. And almost all the village was wiped out. Huh. Tell me a case of where the offer has been invoked and the land remains the same. Oh. We should erase that tradition. Um. That's my hero talking. Mm -hmm. Um. You know. This is one of the reasons why I married you. Oh, please. Let me have peace. Ernest, did you remember the oath you took on my lap? And you went on to neglect my dying wife? Stop the Eze Dibia and die. This is a warning. What is it? Nwem has crippled me. Which Nwem? He shot me with a double barrel. Nwem, 
형은 형은 바스켓볼 시작해 Um, Ikechi, sir. When you get home, tell your uncle that I could not make it coming, as he said. Yes, sir. If there is any message, he should pass it through you while coming back, right? Yes, sir. <coughs> my dear. Who knows whether my mother is still alive? I don't know. When I asked your uncle through the phone, he said he could not reach her. Sir, ever since Uncle Enes subdued us, to deny our mother. I have never known peace. I have never. Don't worry, my dear. It's going to be alright, eh? Yeah? It's going to be alright. Please, as soon as I drop you at the park right now, yes, sir. enter me to straight to the uh, village. Yes, sir. And call me. Is that clear? For me to know the situation of things at the village, right? Yes, sir. Alright. <laughs> now, take this. Thank, Thank, you. Thank you very much. Alright. Tell her that. Uh, my family wishes her quick recovery. Yes, sir. All right. Um, go and dress up. All right. Let me see if I can drop you at the park. All right, sir. Thank you very much, sir. All right. Hey! So they have gotten you at last. Ernest, they have gotten you at last. If first the deeper must come, then I'll not be part of it. Rebecca, you must take part. Unless you have a skeleton in your cupboard. Shame on you! I said shame on you, Ernest! I never knew you were this little livered. So, a mere dream has made you succumb to the anti and demonic genius of Ozronye. Hmm. If it's a mere dream, why am I still lying here? Unable to move along like before. Zuruni must come. Please, my life is precious to me. Rubbish! I said rubbish! Then you are bound to lose it! You have to help me. You have to help me. No, I'm in trouble. Rebecca, oh. take my word. Go and break that bottle to liberate that woman. Else, no, how can you say that, eh? <laughs> Please, you have to help me now. I came to look for a way to prevent them from uncovering my plots. Nani, please, please, I'm in trouble. Are you no longer the dreaded Okoma I used to know? You mean it? Ernest, your late brother in Warem, shooting you in the dream is a clear manifestation that he is not happy with you. Now, where is your wife? My wife left two hours ago. But she will soon be back. Please, nine. Go ahead with the offer. This leg is killing me. It's on fire. Um, Ezra Dibia, go on. I'm here. Our ancestor says that the sea cannot swallow an unseen food. Eh? Yes. Go ahead. Zuronye, people are abolishing the worship of idols. Why then are you inviting them to your brother's house? Please, if you don't know what to say, keep your mouth shut. Oh. Do you know the kind of pain I'm having on this leg? Talk, talk, talk. Now is the day, please go ahead. Ah, what's going on here? Enes. Huh? Enes! So you still allow this to hold? Die, ah, woman! Shut up. Shut up! And don't ever turn to the spirits anymore. If you don't shut up your mouth, 
and we order the gods to make you dumb. Uh, the spirit of a woman man that was sent us. I thank you for this wonderful mass at mm -hmm. Name here. You are welcome. Eh? You can stay with our visitor. Eh? We want to restore peace in this compound. Eh? I'm in support. I thank God. Honey, I hope you don't No, I don't. I'm with you. Goodbye. Daluno. Ah, my, 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 The spirits of Emurim and the ancestors in this Ezurunyoke family, spirits of the living, known and unknown, seen and unseen, I place this offer against every woman, man, child, animal, relation, teen, whoever, whatsoever that has been causing disorder, disunity, enmity division and hatred in this family. May such person, thing or animal never see good. Yeah. Whether the person, thing or animal got it prepared from the house of any native doctor or a spiritual house, whatever, let it boomerang. Yeah. <laughs> Is that not me? I put you the mother. I'm the devil. I I made her a leper. Rebecca. Hey. Hey. A woman that peeps at the midnight masquerade Dances to the drum of the dead unknowingly. Hey! Hey! Mama, Mama, you're healed too. Mama, you're healed. My mother is healed. And it's, and it's been so much. And it's help me, please. And it's help me. Mama, please forgive me. And it's this. And it's this. And it's this. And it's this. She wants to be the one. She wants to rule the world. Her name is authority. Everybody must 